You feel it like it's gonna fall out? Lizzie. Oh yeah. Oh, it's so close. It's like no, hanging no, there. No, no, no. Oh my oh, god. I need more. You need more paper towel? Yeah. Hold on. Here is our gingerbread house. We were gonna do My Little Pony, but when we went to open the box, one of the gingerbread houses was broke. So we went to exchange it and they didn't have another one, My Little Pony. So instead, we the girls chose uh, Elf on the Shelf. And <laughs> it's, uh, you know, <laughs> It looks great. I love it. I actually like how you can you can get these little cutouts now. You can cut these out of the box and add them. That's pretty neat. As far as our own elf on the shelf, this is our elf that we use. His name is Cuddles. We've been using him for probably the last three years. We don't go with the traditional elf on the shelf. This is our little guy. Um, today he's reading a Spiderwick Chronicles book. <laughs> He's just sitting there reading his book. Yesterday he was here on the tree, and let me show you why. Uh, we went to plug in our tree, and a whole layer of tree lights are not working. So the whole like middle section of lights is not working. So yesterday he was, the girls woke up and he was in, in the tree with a little wrench trying to fix, trying to fix the lights, and he didn't have any luck. So. We're gonna have to, um, I'm not gonna buy a whole new tree. I'm just gonna get a box of lights and, and just wrap it around there. So we're gonna probably decorate our tree tomorrow and we'll show you guys what that looks like when it's done. So we're looking for ornaments. I want those, I want those one. That is so cool. Remember Sean when we used to pick you out one every year? Uh -huh. Like this one right now? <laughs> that's actually yeah, Sean doesn't like being on camera. Oh, that's cute, let me see it. Yeah, it's a little gingerbread house. Let me look for one. See if I want it. Daddy! 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 I like how they're all color coordinated. That's so cute. Oh, this is awesome. That is. So Lena likes okay. pink. Lily likes blue. Okay, I, I got she it. Found I her a blue unicorn. You got the. I want this. I changed my mind. So, which one do you want to get? The poodle. The poodle? Yeah. The blue poodle? Yeah. Well, you sure? Like yeah. Okay, I'm gonna pick out two and see what. If you have, I let them go. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. You pick this one. You pick the blue unicorn? Yeah. Alright. So many pretty Christmas ones. I think I'll just. I think I'll get a Christmas one. You wanna get a Christmas, Christmas one? one? Yeah. Okay, yeah. Yeah. Mama, I just like. Oh, and yeah. mommy, mommy, watch yeah. one. Because I did. He wants it. He wants peanuts. Yeah. No. You got peanuts, Chris. <gasps> Don't throw him. Don't. <laughs> oh my God. She won't stay up. Chris, do you want it? <laughs> we're gonna do dance. You want it? Do you want it? <laughs> I think we're gonna dance. I want the one with the mustache. He won't stay. Oh, I'm so glad that this is out of the box Mama, because. How about the, ma the one with the mustache? Mustache. <laughs> that one's actually pretty cool. Is this maracas? It's a hand. I get it. Never. So Lily's now deciding one between so ballerinas. Pretty. Ballerinas. That's beautiful. You guys can pick. I think I'll pick one. You guys can pick. You want me and Daddy to pick? No, the camera you want, can pick. You want, I think, okay, I think so. I'm going to get this one. The camera can pick. The camera can pick. The camera picks. This this girl is really pretty. Yeah. She's beautiful. Let's have her white shoes. <laughs> I'm gonna go with that one? Yeah. All right, awesome. You feel like it's gonna fall out? Lizzie. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's 
so close. It's like hanging there. Oh my god. I need more. You need more paper towel? Yeah. Hold on. You see it? Hey, it's so close to coming out. Yes, Chris. All right, so we've got our tree decorated, and we went to Walmart. The girls ended up going with the, or Lily went with the golden ballerina. She's very pretty. And Elena chose the golden butterfly. It's glass on one side and like a glitter on the other. Very pretty. And did Chris end up picking out one, or we put his back? I think we put his back. Yeah, he was he wasn't being the best baby in Walmart yesterday. <laughs> so we wanted to share with you guys some things that the girls have made over the years or that we've collected for them over the years. Oh yeah, yeah. I will definitely show them the candy canes. We got some candy canes. This is a Hershey's chocolate mint candy cane. Oh, I got our All right. Let's see. Okay, so here is a Christmas tree that Lily made last year in kindergarten. So with some like craft sticks and some buttons. Super cute. For those of you who haven't seen him in our videos, Sean is actually our oldest, my oldest son. He's 16, so you won't see him very much because he doesn't like to be in the videos. But he is uh, our oldest son and he always brought home so many crafty ornaments every year. Here's a Christmas tree that he did one year on like a piece of wood. Super cute. This one's kind of cute. He, they put his picture uh, like with some reindeer antlers and a bow. I wish I had the year. This looks like kindergarten. I want to say most of these were kindergarten, first grade type ornaments. When Christopher was born, he his birthday is December 21st, so we were in the hospital around Christmas time. <laughs> and this was the ornament that they gave him. Isn't that cute? Yeah. All right, here is another one that Sean made in school. And this is his, one of his gingerbreads. So this gingerbread is pretty old. <laughs> he made that one too. Lily brought home this one. You know, they do like the Santa shops in school. So she got this for Sean. Was it for Sean or Christopher? Sean. For Sean last year. And. Oh, yeah. Now, our snowman, it was a gift that she gave too, but it's missing a leg thanks to Christopher last year. <laughs> Here's a really cool one that you guys can do at home. This is just um, like pipe cleaner, like a like a sparkly pipe cleaner, and then you just put beads over it. And Lily did this one last year, so it looks like a candy cane. Here's another gift that Lily brought last year from the shop. So I think that one was for Lena. All right, when the kids were little, or I'm sorry, when Sean was little, I used to take him to Hallmark every year, and he would pick out his own ornaments. So he, you know, was super into superheroes. We've got a Batman one. There's a Spider-Man. Of course, they've broken over the years and have become, I don't know, <laughs> little pieces of things. Um, oh, here's one. There's Li that's Liliana. That's her first Christmas picture. Super cute. We got initial um, ornaments. So E for Emily and Elena. L for Liliana. S for Sean. And... What happened? And J for George, that's dad. But well, we gotta get a C for Christopher. We're missing a C for Chris. So that's just a little glimpse into the story behind some of our ornaments on our tree. So I like it. to get a little crafty. If I can make things myself, I will. So I acquired a lot of free bottles, um, uh, wine bottles, um, just all kinds of bottles. And I just repurposed them. And I found this paint at Walmart. It's just like a, um, a metallic red, and then this was like a Christmas green. And I just painted my bottles and just wrote Merry Christmas. And then I just went to like Dollar Tree and got these these fake 
you know, Christmas looking um, holly with the pine cones. Um, super cute. So that's my new centerpiece on a, on a Santa tray. I <laughs> just wanted to show you guys. I love to get crafty. This is our little village here on, the, on our little bookshelf. Our little Christmas village with our little tree. The girls' artwork is back there on the wall. Just our little little village. Oh, what's he doing there? He's not on right now, but we are in Florida, and Santa's like, you know what? It's just too hot to be in a suit. So at night, we have our little blow-up tropical Santa. He's super cute. We love him. And then I put this on the wall. It's like a little backdrop. Um, I put it low enough so that I can get the kids to kind of stand in front of it. We can take pictures with it. Um, it's super cute. I just keep that on the wall there um, just for some extra decoration, extra fun. So that's pretty cute. We think Itha left that. I'm pretty sure Itha left that for us. So that was awesome of her to do. And then I'm like, you know what? Let me just put it on the wall here. And then we can just do photo ops with the kids. It'd be super cute. So this is pretty much how we just prepare for Christmas. Just do some minor little decorations and you know do our tree and our gingerbread house and that's pretty much it so let us know in the comments below how you guys celebrate uh how you prepare for christmas do you guys go all out with decorations you just do a little bit um you know do you have some special ornaments that you keep on your tree let us know we want to hear from you guys we're excited to see um, what you guys do and uh, we'll talk to you later Give this video a thumbs up. Lily wants to say bye. bye. Lily lost her tooth yesterday. Wait, guys. Did you see where our elf on the shelf is today? Let's show them. He's on the top of our refrigerator today. <laughs> He's just hanging out up there. Hi, Cuddles. So that is it for today's video. If you loved it, give it a big thumbs up. We're going to put all these candy canes on the tree. If we don't eat them first. <laughs> All right, guys, give this video a big thumbs up if you love it. We'll talk to you soon. Bye.